Well, I bought a car wash. Norm's car wash. Let's go inside and check it out. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm Warwick and you're watching Gas Tax Garage. Well, it's been a while and let's jump into what I've been doing. So I have been gone for a while and I'm standing in the reason why. Right behind me or right here is my new business. This is called Car Wash Time, time with a Y. And what it is is a hand car wash in my local area that I'm planning on doing some unique things to. So really it all starts with YouTube and my passion of garages. Now I've looked at starting a different garage business for a while, franchises, different sorts of uh, in-store businesses, obviously YouTube, online, and I determined that the biggest factor in all of this is the money you have to spend on marketing to get the customers. Now YouTube is great, but I am not an e-commerce guru and I don't like the idea of online businesses. There's too many pop-up shops, drop shipping, all these different things out there that I don't have the skills in. What I have the skills in is actually having a physical location, building up a brand and going from there. What I want to do is turn this car wash into the best hand car wash locally and while the customers are coming through the car wash I actually want to educate them about an organized garage if you can see behind me this car wash actually looks like my home garage using residential products in a commercial environment to make sure whatever I sell my customers is actually good quality now a little something that most people don't think about is you use your garage door as your front door most of the time. Your garage is the first and last impression of your home and most people's garages are disorganized. I'm not only talking about the car enthusiast, I'm talking about the, the mother with the children, I'm talking about the, the craft person, the man cave. All of that space, it's a large footprint of your house, is mostly disorganized. And what I am doing here is while people come through the car wash and experience a great hand car Car wash, I will be helping them get the garage organized by using all the products that I have tested and tried over the years and helping them get their space just how they need it. Now for those of you that don't know anything about me and my professional career, well I'm a marketing guy and I'm also a product development guy. I have 17 patents to my name from retail products to retail displays and so on. And that's what I am doing here. I'm creating a unique hand car wash experience while focusing on the great product we give out, which is the car wash, and then also creating a unique experience of an actual car wash that takes passion in what they do. Now I've been gone from YouTube for a while because this business needed a lot of hands-on attention. You see, this hand car wash has been here since the 80s, then it switched hands in 2009, and ever since then it's just been on a decline. So what I'm gonna do is throw up some pictures of before, all the experiences that I had to go through to get this business to what you see it is today. So sit back, enjoy, watch this transformation, because I haven't even watched some of this footage. I actually stopped filming because this business needed a thousand percent of my attention. Well, I bought a car wash. Norm's car wash. Let's go inside and check it out. So it is Friday, 17th of June, 2022. And I just purchased Norm's car wash. This is what it looks like today. This is the entrance. The car wash splits into two here for the vacuuming and drying. back system so this is a hand car wash that's been in the area for about 20 or 30 years uh, but most recently 2009 is when it had this layout so I've got some plans but right now I need to focus on operations making sure the business is running well fixing all these random broken pipes as you can see as well as 
fixing all of the mold. This building needs a nice deep clean. Quality business, it's been here for a while. Get about 20,000 cars a year through here. And it's gonna be one of the next adventures that I take. We got some big plans for the future in this car wash. So make sure you stay tuned to see how a hand car wash is run. Not saying I know how to do that, but that's what I'm gonna learn. Now everyone online is doing self-serve car washes. I haven't seen anyone doing anything like this. So it's gonna be a learning experience for me, hopefully informative for you, but wish me luck. This section here is the detailing section. Fixing bathroom, something happened there. So, to be honest. It's rougher than expected, but should be a nice challenge. Uh, should be able to get this place nice and spiffy, cleaned up. Got some ideas, but I guess we'll see how this adventure turns out. since I purchased the car wash and a lot has happened. So unfortunately I didn't film everything. I only filmed a little bit when I first bought this place, but this place is in need of a lot of work. And today is the first day of renovations. But let me show you around. I'll show you where we stand today.
100% done yet because I'm learning the car wash industry as a whole right now and making sure this place is built out efficiently for my guys to work the best. Be sure you follow my journey with car wash time on Instagram and YouTube and TikTok, all the fun stuff because I'll go in depth about how to run a car wash and is it profitable and how my new concept is working. So guys, thanks a lot for tuning in. I have a lot of stuff coming up on my channel, including a brand new mega RV build, complete off grid, more in detail than the last video, as well as I'm building a contractor trailer specifically for this business. So when I go out to customers' homes and do their garage installs, I can be efficient with my time. So guys, there's a quick little update. Stick around, thanks a lot, and I'll see you next.